I think last season we, we, we did well against the Lackley. Uh, and uh, why? Uh, it's because uh, I think we, we, we played tactically really well against them. Uh, but all the games against the Lackley is, 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 is difficult. And uh, I feel like they, they have been improving under the, the coach. I see a lot more structure in their game. They are tactically improving a lot, in my opinion. So, uh, and it showed in the last game against a, a good Vakra team uh, and a good win for, uh, for Akli in, in, in the last game. So we expect them to be first with a high confidence. Second, uh, I think they will build on this win and they will be a really tough team to meet at, at this stage. Yeah, it was really, it was really disappointing, and uh, it was, uh, yeah, it hurt to lose the two points because first, of, first of all, uh, we played really well in the first half. Should have uh, finished the game in in first half, uh, and a lot of superiority. So we were really happy with uh, with the first half performance, uh, and we didn't deserve to lose, but. Uh, all the credit to, to Alcor, they never gave up and they got themselves uh, into the game or, or we got them into the game. So I think, number one, we, we are both happy and unhappy. So it, it's which way you look at it. I think we are happy with uh, the, especially the first half performance. Some of the best football we have played uh, since after the Corona break. Uh, but again, we are unhappy not to... to to keep a 2-0 lead, this is something that we should do. But uh, and what happened is, is two, two, uh, I can say one mistake and a really good goal for Milal, and and uh, nothing we can we can do about a strike like this. Uh, you cannot defend a strike like this. So all the credit to 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 Alcor, but we are disappointed and and uh, it hurt a lot to to lose the two points in the 94th minute. Uh, no, we, 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 we stopped playing on the front foot, so we started to, to uh, how can I say, we, we started to defend our lead uh, instead of go keep on going forward, keep on trying to score more goals. We started to, to be uh, more defensive, which sometimes happens in games when you, when you have the lead. And then uh, changes uh, because of cramps we needed us to change the team, so we were, we were disorganized. For for uh, for this and, and like I said, uh, also Alcor made changes. So it's not only Arabi. It was a, it was a good also for for Alcor. And we, we should we always respect our opponents. And uh, in this case, let's say they they deserved because they never gave up. But of course, we should have won this game. Of course, we should have won this game because uh, we were a much better team uh, in the game. And this normally should be enough to win the game, but sometimes in football, like you know, uh, it's not enough. First and foremost, it's, it's, uh, we have to be tactically disciplined, really tactically disciplined. They have fast players, good, uh, good players on the ball uh, with speed and technique. Uh, this, is, this is their strength, and now they are getting better and better defensively organized. And uh, like I said before, I think uh, the coach is doing a good work with al -Akli. And uh, it was a good win last game. So we have to be careful uh, when, we, when we meet al at this stage of the, of the season, because now they have confidence, which they didn't have before, uh, a long run of, uh, of no wins. So now they, they have confidence, they are starting the league well. And, uh, and we have to be careful in, in the approach because they have players who can finish games. Yeah, it's, it's strange to, to, have, uh, to have only three days bet between games. It would be okay in, uh, in an air-conditioned uh, stadiums, but uh, in the last game we had uh, injuries, cramps so 
we have to be careful and, and, and this is why we have to save energy uh, for the game. So the preparation has been more or less a recovery uh, and this will be for the, these games because we, we have to have a full tank of gasoline before every game and, uh, and to, to train hard between difficult matches in, uh, in a heat and a, and a humidity like it is today. It's, it's difficult to train much. So we try to preserve the energy of the players and recover them uh, with the physios and fitness coaches and uh, the massage therapists. So it's more or less their job between games than the coaches. And then we have to do both on the pitch and, and, uh, and meetings, uh, how we were going to play and, and, and do the tactics maybe in one session. So it's a strange preparation for games now, but this is our circumstances and we have to adapt. Uh, it would probably be okay to do this in, in the beginning of the season if we, we had a, a, a long rest and then a pre-season preparing for this, but it's still the same season from last year and everybody is quite tired. So to play in this heat in, in a, a non-air-conditioned stadium is, is a dangerous for the players, so we have to protect them with a low load between games. I hope so. I hope this draw will, will affect our performance because we should learn from this game. Even though we are a better team, no game is won in the first half. So at least we should learn from this. But I hope we will play again the same way we did in the first half. And I hope we will repeat this against Alakli, but uh, we have to do the same in the second half or, or all the game, all the 90 minutes. We have to play like we played the first half against Al Khor. So I hope this will affect how we play in the future because every game is a, is a learning curve for us, for this team. It's a, a lot of young players and it's our job as coaches to, to help them learn and, and improve year by year. Of course, we like to win every game, but it's also a long-term development. We, we, like to, we like to improve as a team for the future as well.